Greeny Sloan, and most of pe these people were dead when I got there. And this church evolved out of Little Dove Church, and most of these people belong to Little Dove. Dora Harmon, Alfred Cheney, knew him well, Frankie Thacker, Floyd Cheney, Sally West, Wallace Thacker, Daisy Thacker, Carlton Sloan, Burton Harris, Burton Thacker, Nancy Sarah Cheney, James Harmon, Mildred Harmon, Avery Lowell, whom I knew, Rufus Harmon, Emma Jane Ratliff, Robert Newsom, Lucy Kendrick, Dolly Cure, who was our former pastor's wife, Clyde Cure, former pastor, wonderful person, loved him dearly. No, they more than I can say. He was a wonderful person. Bill Cheney, he was a deacon up there. He got killed in a car crash. The Johnny Thacker, he was a pastor up there formerly. Angie Tackett, Polly Tackett, his wife. Sharon Anderson, Sarah Cheney, David Cheney, Eulen Thacker, <coughs> Ethel Thacker, Sally Hall. Columbus Hall, Mandy Thacker, John Thacker, Hubert Thacker, Sally West, William Thacker, Hobart Justice, Shook Sloan, Danny Hall, Holly Thacker, Lori Cheney, Marianne Elizabeth Ward, Lassie Sloan, who was my mother-in-law, Phyllis's mother, died very recently. Wonderful old sister. 97 years old when she died. Thank you. want to welcome everybody and thank God for this gathering and for this church. We owe so much. To the people who've gone before, we owe to the Jews. They suffered under that law forever. It was a horrible life to live. All the law was being forced to tell them that you're sinners and prepare them for the coming of the Lord. And some of them were prepared. We owe a lot to the preachers. I've known some wonderful preachers who preached the gospel to me, caused me to have faith, and drew me to Christ. Under their preaching, I heard the gospel. The gospel is a mighty thing and a mighty light to this world. And I thank God it's preached from this pulpit. And our children hear it. I got a grandchild here that was drawn through the gospel. And he's young yet, and I thank the Lord for him. Most of all, I want to thank our blessed Lord. I thank God who sent his son to suffer and die for us. And I thank that son who came and opened up this grace world, this grace covenant for us that we might have love and mercy introduced us to his real father. Not that the Jews did, but he told us who God really was, told us and showed us that this was the acceptable year of the Lord. He's still reaching out his hand to come unto me. Still reaching out to the world to come unto him and let's get ready and go to heaven. Amen. We've got a wonderful world here, but the best is yet to come. I love living. I love life. I love the gospel. I love my Lord. I like the time I spend with Him. I love my nights together with Him and my days with Him. 
Want everybody to get ready and let's go to heaven together. Jesus sent a message and he said, I'm coming quickly. You'll be surprised. You're not going to be looking for me. You come, I'm coming in an hour when you think not. People are going to be surprised when he comes. I know they say he's going to split the eastern sky and that's natural, but that's not what he says. He gave a parable and said, As light, lightning, in a flash, I'm coming. And you won't be, be prepared for me. Now's the time to get prepared and get ready because he's going to call and we're going to answer, and I'm waiting for that call. He knows my name, and wherever I am, he knows where I am. We've got a good God, and he's very much aware of his people. And he's prepared for us, prepared for our coming, preparing us to meet him. They sing a song, I want to meet him face to face. I want to thank him for that one drop of blood he shed for me. All my life to him. As he brother will sing, I feel good. I'm glad to be your Lord in this house today. Yes, Sing a song, give each brother time for a little prayer.